What we have here, guys, is a 2004 BMW 330Ci convertible. Um, this car is a flood salvage car. It has a salvage Florida rebuildable title. Um, the customer reported the car was flooded to the insurance company and the insurance company then salvaged it. Um, we bought the car and could not find any sign of any sort of flood damage um, at all. So we're, we believe it was a scam, but we're not really sure. Just wanted to point out some of the cosmetic issues on the car. It does have a little sun fade in a few spots. Um, the bumper is lifted a little bit right there. Um, basically, I think is when the transporters moved it, it probably peeled it up a little bit. It's still secured very tight, but um, that's what we believe the problem with the bumper is. Um, if you look at the car, it's, it's very straight, very clean, very nice, beautiful car. Just some minor paint blemishes. Um, that's really it. This is probably the worst thing if you look um, on, the, on the top of this bumper face. Kind of hard to see in the sun. Um, but it goes all the way around to the other side. Um, like I said, very sleek, very nice car. The convertible top works. It does something a little funky. Um, it does go up and down. But um, I'm not sure if um, the pump is squeaky or flowing fluid or something like that. I don't, I don't know a whole lot about these cars. Um, uh, convertible top systems. I don't claim to be an expert in something like that. But if you look, the car's pretty. Very nice, very clean. Six speed car. Uh, very fun to drive, very quick. Um, no lack of power, um, as you can see. Um, for a car that supposedly had flood damage, it sure doesn't have any electrical issues at all. Everything works properly. AC is ice freaking cold. Um, this is probably one of my favorite cars, one of my favorite BMWs that we've bought. I love the 3 Series, the 330 CIs are, are a blast to drive, but this one is a 6-speed, which makes it even funner. Um, I'm going to point out some problems that I did see. Um, pretty much all the windows um, have sun burn damage on the tint, which basically just means the car sat with rolled up windows in the sun occasionally, and just like the paint, the tint's starting to fade start to peel. Um, all four windows will need to be re-tinted. Uh, but other than that, I, the car's pretty much um, pretty much beautiful. A little funky uh, rear view there. Fun car to drive though. So we're going to do a little run drive as you can see. And the car is uh, very responsive. Cars that we've bought in the past with issues of flood um, I've always needed something, a pedal, a coil, or something. Um, the only thing this thing needed was a coil. Um, and that doesn't have anything to do with flooding at all. These coils are just known for going bad. So, I just wanted to do a little, uh, little run drive video. Everything works. Um, even the traction control. through all six gears very nicely um, 60 miles an hour and we got there pretty quick um, the car runs down the road straight uh, doesn't pull one way or another that's no handed right there still running on the road straight pull a little bit to the left but nothing serious the road is pitched a little bit to the left as well so um, like I said guys very fun car to drive very quick um, it's not a race car or anything, but um, it, it moves pretty good. Uh, so, uh, I with confidence that this is a nice car, that it runs well, and it would be easily retitled.